In his mask and combat gear, you could be forgiven for mistaking him for just another member of the anti-government camp protesting in Ukraine. But his weapon of choice is something rather different. The piano. Armed with nothing more than his ability to tinkle the ivories, the protester keeps his identity a closely guarded secret for fear he might be arrested, or worse, if police find out who he is. For now, he says, he is playing for victory. There are a lot of musicians out there, and here, when I play, they didn't just walk by. They stopped, they thanked me, and said all kinds of warm words and told me that this supports them a lot. It inspires them, giving them fresh strength. That is my primary function. I must play, play and play for the people until victory. The protesters are now in their third month of a campaign against the president's decision to sign a trade deal with Russia instead of the EU. At least six people have died in violent clashes so far this year. And with accusations flying of attacks by police, this mystery man's music is one of few comforts the group has left.